So a good looking field of mares are lining up in behind that Metro Home Building Center starting gate for the afternoon's 13th race. Let's go back upstairs to Vance Cameron. Right one, I'll tell me ma. Tell me why, Dusty Lane Sunday. Woodmere Roll Lily rocked the baby. Traces of purples outside. They're on the gate here in the 13th. Top of the stretch. Now approaching a start. Rough and pacing. Tell me why leaves out. Right one along the rail. Joining them is Woodmere Roll Lily as they make their way into the turn. Racing from fourth up on the outside. Dusty Lanes and Daya. I'll tell me ma. She gets away fifth. Rock the baby sixth. Then the early trailer. Traces of purple. Their quarter pole bound. Right one at the rail. Woodmere Roll Lily on the outside. And another two it and at it. Add it and do it up front. And Miles Senior says I want to lead it. And he does aboard right one. Murner's force for the two-hole ride with Woodmere Roll Lily, 28. Three opened it up. Tell me why around the turn third, Dusty Lanes and Day of Fourth. Then in fifth, it's all tell me, Ma. Six and edging out is Rock the Baby. Trailing the field, traces of purple. There goes the backfield in motion as they arrive at the opening half mile. Led by right one. She's halfway home. Second is Woodmere Roll Lily. First up, I'll tell me, Ma. Third. Following the second over cover in the outside fourth, that is Rock the Baby. 58 and four for a half a mile fifth up the rail that is tell me why on the outside traces of purple is six now the trailer that is dusty lane zendaya three-quarter pole bound led by right one right up and at her on the outside i'll tell me ma coming on to take over rock the baby on the outside third racing fourth woodmere roll lily has nowhere to go then in fifth traces of purple dusty lane zendaya wow she's picking them off on the outside three quarters in one 29 and three homeward bound check out dusty lane zendaya way wide with the lead i'll tell me ma woodmere roll lily found a way out deep stretch now dusty lane zendaya in line to cory mcpherson will win second is woodmere roll lily rocked the baby third in one 59 Three. 13th race now under a judge's inquiry. Retain your tickets here in the 13th. There is a judge's inquiry. Here comes the slow-mo replay for the afternoon's 13th race, Kurt. And sometimes, you know, the outcome of a race can be changed just by Who's cutting it all out? Yeah, right one one to cut it here for Heffernan, and uh, he let go up the back stretch, and that set the stage for the four Dusty Lanes and Dea. She's got such a beautiful burst of speed for a piece of a mile. McPherson used it at the right time here today. She picked them up and put them down here, and she's going to circle the field. What a brush to the front here. Breathtaking by Dusty Lane Zendaya. She gets it done. A nice trip here, 159 and 3. Adam Murner is going to do some serious stick handling to get out of that spot that he was in, in behind right one. And he's going to get up the inside for the deuce. But Dusty Lane Zendaya gets it done here in the 13th. Big trip. We'll see Dusty Lane Zendaya and McPherson in the winner's circle next. Ladies and gentlemen, the judge's inquiry involves the conduct of the 13th race at the 7 8 pole. Dusty Lane Zendaya is in the 13th race winner's circle. Bay Pacing Mare, she's nine by Om Canadian now. From the boss of the beach dam, the boss daughter. She's owned and trained by Alexis Gass of Cornwall and driven a victory by Corey McPherson. 
The time for the mile in a 159 and three. Dusty Lane Zendaya in the 13th. Okay, here's a look at the ongoing judges' inquiry. They're taking a look at racing action here in race 13 at the 7-8. So here it is a look at the slow-mo camera view of what the judges are looking at here in race 13. Hold on to all tickets. Ladies and gentlemen, here's the results of the 13th race judges' inquiry. There has been a placing. Number five, Woodmere Roldley, has finished second and will be placed seventh for causing interference to numbers one and seventh after the three quarters. Woodmere Roldley, second place, seventh for interference.
It's the official results now in race number 13. Right one finished seventh place six. I'll tell me Ma finished fourth place third. Tell me why finished fifth was placed fourth. Dusty Lanes and Dale was the race winner. Woodmere Roll Lily finished second, was placed seventh for interference in numbers one and seven. Rock the Baby finished third, was placed second. Traces of Purple finished sixth and was placed fifth. The fractions were 28 and 3, 58 and 4, 129 and 3, and the mile 159 and 3. In review, after the placing, 6, 3, 4, 1, 7, 2, 5. Dusty Lanes and Day have paid 980. The Exactor, 20. Triactor, 325.40. Super Factor was 389.18. Red Shore, Charlottetown, and Summerside presented the Holiday Home Stretch Handicapping Challenge. And congratulations to the overall winner with the most points, Ken Oaks, uh, followed by David Watts, who were in second place, and Daniel Godfrey finished 